Hi everybody, my name is Katerina. Thank you so much for watching my YouTube channel and of course subscribe my YouTube channel. Love you more than ice cream. Today I'm introducing or bringing to you newest eyeshadow palette from MAC. We have a six colors here. We have here matte, we have shimmer. It's supposed to be 25% more pigments than previous collection. i be honest with you, some eyeshadow pigment some it's not my favorite it's this color it's beautiful beautiful color again it's 30 dollars for six eyeshadow it's still I will list below all products which one I use today on me because you will see me with makeup and without makeup but I think this is so beautiful for every day or like it's just beautiful clean look it's like makeup no makeup okay let's start you can see guys my skin it's not perfect i have discoloration pigmentation sometimes i'm very dry sometimes i feel like i'm oily right now i feel like my skin combinational to oily i'm gonna use first mac primer oh sorry mac serum and this is its skin balancing hydrating serum it is very light texture it's not creamy it's not rich it's just very good like hydrating light texture serum then for my moisturizer i actually gonna use this is a sample i cannot find where is real product but i do have it's my favorite i'm obsessed right now ysl primer glowing balm primer it's a basically moisturizer and primer together if you are combinational to dry or dry you must have this product it's not expensive i believe 39 dollars but i use an every day and i'm enjoying 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 this product and for my eye area i'm gonna use uh, eye cream from la mer and this is it's a eye concentrate for lines wrinkles and dark circles and i will use under and on top my eyelid because my eyelid a little bit dry And now I'm gonna use another primer. Why? Because I have large pores and this primer from MAC, it's named Modifying 12 Hour Shine Control Primer. I will apply only right here where I have large pores in center and right here. And I like how foundation goes. After skincare, I'm using Claire Depot Radiant Fluid Matte Finish Foundation. I will not say it's a matte matte finish, but it's definitely full coverage. And of course, I'm using right now this brush from MAC. I love this brush. You can see see how beautifully go uh, foundation on my skin and again because i have discoloration pigmentation i like to use full coverage foundation this foundation stay really really good okay we're almost done you can see foundation still have a glow yes like i looks a little bit pale my color it's number 20 but actually in real life it's a perfect match for me but we're gonna put powder we're gonna put bronze we are gonna make my skin flawless <laughs> i know how to make skin look beautiful now i'm gonna use pro long concealer from mac it's a full coverage concealer long wearing concealer this is one of my favorite concealer from MAC and I'm using first a brush this is brush from um, Chanel it's a concealer brush and I plan concealer a little bit here a little bit here a little bit right here just 
little bit spread in this concealer and then actually I'm gonna use a beauty blender and I'm just gonna go one more time to blend everything now you can truly see how I'm 10 years younger with the right foundation and concealer now because I look a little bit pale I'm gonna use bronze I'm gonna use cream bronze from Clinique yes it's not expensive one but it's really really good one and I'm using like a brush like this from MAC I forgot what number it is but I will list it below all products and I apply this bronze on my brush and I just you can see how I push and push in this bronze like close to my hairline then I'm going to put little bit little bit bronze right here then I have a little bit bronze on my brush and I'm just gonna put a little bit, little bit right here. It's not like I'm contouring, contouring my nose, just very slightly. Okay, I have foundation, I have concealer, I have bronze, and you can see how pretty my skin looking now. Now I'm gonna use loose powder from MAC, I really like it. It's a brand new loose powder, and it's a blurring uh, powder. My color is light, and I'm gonna just apply with big brush, and I'm gonna set my makeup, because I want my makeup stay all day long. Now I'm gonna use my Beauty Puff and I have a very, very little powder on my lid, very little. And basically I'm gonna right now set my concealer. Now I'm gonna use highlighting uh, powder from MAC. I love this highlighting powder. If you are with me for a long time, this is my favorite. For my blush, I'm gonna use brand Physician Formula and it's Mavi Matte Color. Look how cute this is. <laughs> it's coming with brush underneath, but I'm gonna use my brush. This blush actually looks like a pale, but it's not. It's giving me a pretty good color. Now I'm gonna quickly fill my eyebrows, then I'm gonna use MAC eyeshadow primer, it's my favorite, and then we're gonna use eyeshadow. Eyebrows done, and again, I'm looking younger and younger and younger. What you seeing, guys? I actually need to say thank you so much for subscribing my YouTube channel, for following me on Instagram, Katya Beauty Style. Love you more than ice cream. We little bit growing by growing, but again, this is a channel if you want to look young, if you want like look makeup, no makeup, that's it. I'm here for you. Okay, let's Let's use eyeshadow. I'm gonna apply in, an entire my eyelid eyeshadow primer and then eyeshadow and I promise it's gonna be something very simple. We have six colors here but we're not gonna use all six. Let's start with this color. This is like it's a matte neutral color and I'm gonna apply almost an entire my eyelid. Look at how beautiful this first color. Again, I like to use eyeshadow, love to use makeup, but I don't like to, like people say, oh my God, she has too much makeup. Because first of all, it's gonna age me. And then if you don't know how to blend perfectly, it can look awful. <laughs> Now I have an angle small brush. This is actually eyebrow brush, but I'm gonna use this beautiful brown metallic color. This is actually a color very pigmented. 
and this color I apply on kind of my starter from center of my eyelid applying very very close to my lash line just halfway and same color I'm gonna use underneath now I have a blending brush and I'm just gonna a little bit soft this eyeshadow underneath and also blending a little bit on my top same eyeshadow I'm gonna apply on my blending brush and I'm just gonna put a little bit more right here in the corner now we have with you this matte color right here and I'm just gonna apply a little bit, little bit more above my suckle area. This is its suckle area, and I apply a little bit, little bit above. You can see eyeshadow looks so soft, so natural. It's like makeup, no makeup, and it's not age me these colors at all now i have north brush it's my favorite small blending brush and we are actually gonna use it it's darker matte color and i'm gonna put right here on my corner oh it's getting rain big big rain outside ah And I have maybe a little bit left this darker eyeshadow. I'm going to put slightly also underneath and just blend everything. Now I have a big blending brush and I'm just going to little bit blend everything. All these colors together. And it looks natural. But it's like natural little bit smoky. We don't see a much like transition between colors. This is what I like right now. Don't see this big chunk, you know, transition color. This is very soft, very natural. My shadow looks so pretty. Now I'm going to use my finger and we're gonna use this matte color and I'm just applying right here on the corner of my eye we almost finished now I'm gonna use the lighters color which one we have in this palette and I'm gonna apply a little bit little bit above my brow bone and same color right here in the corner now I'm going to use lash curler and I'm going to curl my lashes. Now I'm going to use waterproof eyeliner from Lancome. It's ivory. It's a beautiful green color. I'm going to use underneath my lashes and then I'm going to put on top. I want this extra pop. And now, because I'm an older lady, I need a magnified mirror. Simple, oh, simply hue and mirror is the best. The best mirror to use to apply eyeliner, mascara, or do your eyes. It's the best. And we have light here. You can control how bright you want your light. But I definitely, I always use for my mascara, for my eyeliner, because I want my eyeliner looks perfect. I don't know if you're here or not, but we have a so huge rain outside. It's like emergency situation. SOS girls, if you please support me, give me thumbs up, subscribe my YouTube channel, love you more than ice cream. And let's finish this look. I'm gonna use Lancome primer, it's my favorite. If you want your lashes to look like bigger, longer, healthy, this is it's your you must have this product don't skip it's the best which you can have for your lashes I'm telling you <laughs> and then I'm gonna use mascara from brand melt I really like this mascara it's give me nice beautiful volume I 
have mascara now I decide I'm gonna use my nude eyeliner on my waterline on the bottom it's gonna give me nice beautiful extra pop and I will not look tired now i'm gonna use makeup forever powder and it's a belief translucent or blurring powder it's white one and i put it on my puff i go underneath and i clean i lift in my eyes and it's extra lift without plastic surgeon it's right here <laughs> For my lips, I'm gonna use three products. I'm gonna use lip liner from Chanel. It's uh, 158 Rose Natural, the number 61 waterproof long wearing lipstick from, uh, again, it's a mark. It's so hard for me to pronounce the name Mitchev, but it's number 61. And we're gonna finish with this beautiful pink, pink color from my of course I'm gonna put I'm gonna list it all products for you I'm gonna let dry my lipstick for one two minutes and then I'm gonna use lip gloss this lip gloss little bit sticky or oh, I will say sticky sticky but I'm okay this is lipstick lip gloss lip liner gonna stay all day long okay girls what do you think I think I look way more younger <laughs> okay please subscribe my youtube channel love you more than ice cream and I will see you in my next video